Now, from your hyper-local weather source, this is your NORCAST weather update. Brought to you by Square Theatres, with locations in Northfield, Ventnor, and Stone Harbor. Experience movie watching like never before as you recline on comfortable lounge chairs and drift into another world. Get your tickets today by visiting squaretheaters.com. Happy Tuesday, everyone. Overnight tonight, cool and quiet. Temperatures falling back down mostly into the mid to upper 50s, but a few lucky spots will be holding on to those 60 degree temperatures. Mostly along the water, you can see Cape May, Atlantic City, even Fortescue staying in the low 60s. Marlton, always a few degrees warmer than all of its neighbors, dropping down to about 60 degrees. We are still looking ahead to fall. Again, today and tomorrow will be very mild, but we are looking towards some cooler weather later on towards next week. We're only about 11 days off from that first day of fall 50 days off from your Halloween and then Thanksgiving is only 78 days away so before you know it we'll be uh, racing through autumn and already looking ahead to our winter uh, holidays and our winter forecasts as well looking at tomorrow beautiful bright skies lots of sunshine out there temperatures back up into the low 80s for a decent portion of our area that high pressure stays in control we're keeping an eye on the tropics we still have those two areas of potential development we have that more western and southern patch of development. It's uh, starting to kind of fall apart a little bit. It's being sort of overtaken by that patch that's a little bit further to the east, down to about a 30% chance over the next two to seven days. Meanwhile, our larger potential development area is up to a 40 or 80% chance of development over the next couple of days. So we are keeping our eyes on that area for the next week or so. We're tracking Francine. It's going to continue that track up to the north. I'd say by midweek this week, it's heading on to the uh, Louisiana coastline right along the Gulf, continuing to push north throughout the end of the work week and then by the weekend it's post tropical it's more of just a run of the mill low and we're seeing pretty significant rain for a big portion of the Ohio River Valley and even portions of the southeast we will be seeing some of that moisture it'll be rolling across our area kind of pushing towards that east coast at some point next week but before we get there we just have a whole lot of sunshine and pretty mild temperatures on the way Okay, hope you enjoy the rest of your night. Stay safe, sleep tight, and I will check in with you tomorrow.